Hello, what up, guys? What's up, everybody? You welcome to my channel once again. It's your boy, Famous Nelson. And in today's video, we'll be doing some beat review. Some beat review. Please, if you're new to my channel, consider to subscribe and click on the bell icon to get notified when I upload a new video. So, I have this Afro beat instrument I made here early this morning. And I feel like sharing it with you guys so that you can learn one or two stocks from it. So, um, before we get to the review, let's play the beat and um, I'll show you how I made everything from scratch. So, let's go. instrument I had the first thing I did was um I played those um, guitar those guitar and um this is how it sound For this sand, I took the sand from um from my amp sand from the DWD sampler from those guitars here. It's called Bassman Plug. So I added reverb to it and um, I added Octodoc and FX tuned as well. So the next sand I added was a flute. For the flute, I just copied those guitar sand. And I paste it at yet. So this is how it sounds. So after that, I bring in something like a bass guitar. And for the bass guitar, I played something like this. So after this I added my checker and it's an Afro beat checker and this is how it sounded. So 
when you plus all of them. So when you add these four sounds together, it becomes gives you something like this. So I feel like I needed something in the background, so I played some voice from um, DW Sampler, and this was how it sounded. So if I add this to these sounds, it becomes something like this. So at this point, this um for this voice, I took a voice from um DW samplers like I told you, it's called Vela Ha. So I had a reverb and um I added um, FX equalizer and auto dock. So after this, I felt like okay, the melodies are okay right now, so I need my drums. So I went to the drums, and for the drums, it's this way. I'm sorry. For the drums, I have my. It's a percussion sound from wood. It's called FL FPC Wood It from FL Precept. Then I took a shaker and the shaker and the wood I played them this way. Like I told you, this other one is just the shaker. You can see how it sounds. So after that, I added my kick, and um, it's this way. After adding the kick, I added my conga, and it sounds like this. This is the conga. So everything together went this way. Then I added a box. So everything went this way. So I swing it a little. I always tell you if you want your beat to get that lively vibe, you have to swing it. So I swing it a little and um if we play the beat, those melodies and chicas. Everything gives So normally usually professional beats you don't really need to add more stuff to them. Professional professional producers don't add much items, much samples. They just make use of few samples and they had lots of effects, that's it. So after doing this I feel like I need something like um sax. So for the sax I played something like this. I played it using my phone screen. I used my phone screen and I was able to get something like this. No, I don't really know how to play keyboards but it turned this way. So, when you listen to Hall, it went this way. So, I placed the sax in the intro part and everything sounded like this. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let's listen.
the bees. For the bees, I played something very simple and unique. I just just this one key. This is what I was already playing for the bees. Just this one key, and this is how it sounded. Please, if you need sample packs, contact me. I take sample packs, but you can pay using paper. So, if you can pay using paper, then contact me for sample packs. Then after that, I needed some effect, so I added some effect. That was um, I added a clap, a clap that has reverb, and this is how it sounded. Sorry. So after that, I added something like a riser and this is how it sounded this riser is what actually linked the bags and the chorus together i mean the intro and the first bags together so and then i also added something like um i also added a drum roll and this is how it sounded And the final thing I did was um, I added something like a flute. I took a flute from DW Sampler and I added reverb to it and um, I played this with my screen. So everything together looks like this. please make sure you subscribe to my channel and don't forget to click the notification bell to get notified when i upload any other video bye thanks for watching